This is cool. So hacking type, logic only. Oh, I love that. That's super, that's super good. I just, the reflex isn't fun for me. Logic is, I mean, it's a bit basic, but it's fun. Why did you wash your hands? Thoroughly. Always. Okay, let's try the elevator. We haven't actually tried the elevator yet. And I'm not really seeing any other immediate ways out of here. It looks like there might be a couple others. But maybe I can go up another level. Okay, so I'm in the level 2 lobby. Yeah, so we've been here before. Hmm. I got everything out of this area. So I'm hungry. I guess let's shoot back upstairs. It doesn't seem like it can go down. I feel bad that I'm lost. It'd be nice if I could actually see the entire map of the zone instead of just like a smidge of it. So let's cross back over to the gene lab and see if there's a door here that I missed. Because that's locked off. Did I go this way? It's a dead end, but there's a wall. Okay. I... I'll be honest. I don't actually know the way out of here. You wanna... Somebody wanna point me in the right direction so I'm not... I don't just spend the next five minutes wandering around? Oh, right. Isn't there an ability? Options. Uh, key binding. Yeah, so we have to go to a completely different location. Use Pan Pamela ability Q. Sector power is off. Damn it. Okay, I'm still kind of hurt too. So I'm going to pop the adre adrenaline. Hypo. Okay, I guess that didn't help as much. All right, let's go try flipping the power back on again. and Because it worked for like half a second and then it was like Bleh. but I don't have anything that specifically let me fix it unless I have to build it I'm lacking the materials now it looks like she just sticks with me as a light That's cool. Not what I was looking for. I'm thirsty. Yeah, so we want to go to Arcadia. I just haven't seen any entrances or exits or anything that leads to Arcadia. I turned on the emergency power with the hopes that we'd be able to... Uh, to, like, open a gate or something, but I... I don't know. So I'm assuming it's not in the cryo clinic. Did it go back this way? Maybe I haven't been back here. Yep, okay, this is promising. Okay. Yeah, this this looks kind of exit-ish. Now, unfortunately, I am thirsty. I tried to enter the deep frame today. Security measures not of my own forcibly ejected by inquisitive eyes. Gosh, that thing breaks, like, in a second. Doesn't even do a whole lot of damage. Emma cried today, and I asked her why. She said sometimes humans cry to let pain escape. 
but it didn't make sense at the time. Okay, this is looking a little bit more promising. It's definitely looking a little less dark. I just have to not die before I can actually make something useful of this. Okay, got anything neat back here? No. Why does this man have... Is that just missing a texture? I think it is. Uh, these are all medical stuff, yeah? Yeah, except for a security bypass. What are you? Bone refabricator. Interesting. Also, did I get a... I might have gotten an upgrade bit. Or did I get one of the Pamela tokens? Nope, didn't get any compute cells. Don't know what I'm missing. Oh, I'm sorry. What? Is that? Okay, that's a little concerning. Oh, I do have a level 2 upgrade token. It's pink. Huh. Oh, I do. So can I just not upgrade this one any further? Oh, I see. This is a level 2 token. So I need more of the level 1 tokens. I got it. But until we get to that higher tier, it's meaningless. I know I've said it a bunch of times, but I really like these puzzles. I'm glad that I had the option to choose. Is it that? Yeah, it's gotta be. I think we're good. Yep. Alright, I got a heat sink and some other goodies. A lot of dead people all over the place. Unsurprisingly. Hello, fools. We had... A seaweed sandwich, but none of that is food. Okay, I think that one's right to begin with. It's so convenient when it just hand, hands one of the solutions to me. Ooh, what are you? Kinetic amplifier. Seems neat. Let's see, now... This one's lit up as though it's lootable, but I guess it's not. Alright, can I get you open? I can. I get the distinct feeling I'm probably going to regret. Oh, gosh. This even... This is... Concern. I like the idea of this. The ex actual execution is problematic. But we got it. All right. Open this door. Uh, my vitals are critical. Okay, so whatever's on the other side of that is death.
Well, I guess this was not the correct direction to go for progress. Who are you? Tonal silencer. Another goodie. All right. Uh, let's see. So what are... That's a utility. I have a tonal silencer, but I have a tonal silencer plus. Sanguine die? Okay, my vitals are no longer critical. Had another one of these. We had some whiskey. And we got some coffee. Okay, so I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna die of hunger or thirst. Really at least a little while. So That's that's a bad place to be, but that was the closest I had to finding an escape. Unless, of course, that is the escape, and I just have to clo- Uh... I have to just book it anyway. It's a possibility. Because I've been- Have I been the other direction? Well, I should murder this guy, no matter what. Where are you even coming from, good sir? I wonder if you can permanently- whoops. I wonder if you can permanently, like, kill all the enemies in this game. I've been really wanting to play a, a zombie survival or just a survival game like that. Ah, oh, I guess this was a way out. I was just assuming the shutters were not, not, uh, possible. Like, you couldn't open them up, but, eh. Got this scan. Got good as. Jacob wants me to take more control of Eden's subsystems, starting with the solar sail. This must be what Emma described as pride. Okay. So I think we're good. This seems safer. We have a lot of money. I might want to go back to one of the stores and buy things. This is a vending machine with just food in it, yeah? Looks like it. What are you? Nutricube. A water bottle. Roulette vodka. So it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to get anything other than foodstuffs from that. It's like nothing against foodstuffs. But I'm kind of assuming that I'm going to die soonish anyway. It means I should probably spend my money on other things. Or move I my base. When maintaining the surveillance grid. It had been lost there during some routine repair work. I made some space in a partition of the server for him. I hear, I think, a robot out there, and it's spooky sounding. To the promenade, to origin station. Oh, what about the other direction? Because we're looking for... Arcadia. Okay, I'll start by poisoning her. There's a widow up ahead. She's got poor vision, but excellent hearing. Be very careful. <clears throat> I wow. Okay. Yep. Kind of knew I was gonna die. Right then and there. Almost tonight. Almost to the next level. Okay, uh, let's see. So merc mercantile, superior hemoglobin. Let's take a look at the rest of these. So extra health. No. So trauma mitigation, hacking expertise, melee force. 
Residence damage reduction. Food consumption. Ooh. Regenerative tissues just gives you HP regen. Rare loot finds. Okay. Um... I'm pretty sure that's more stamina. I could be wrong. Let's just go for those for mercantile. I'm not sure if this is actually that helpful, but still useful. So we didn't find the Arcadia Tower Bay. Garrison Bay, Nirvana Bay. What I should have done was just poison the shit out of her and just stayed the heck away. Okay, I think we'll do one more life and then we will uh, switch gears. I'm enjoying this game. I'm glad that we're finally getting out of the extremely dark area. But yeah, this is reminding me of, honestly, Prey Moon Crash in a very solid manner. No time limit, though, which is actually quite nice. The time limit is mainly how many resources I have, and I'm assuming after a certain point, we just become... Uh, what is going on with my arm? Why am I just in a perpetual state of... Tension. Well, I don't know. I, my character, I think, has developed some kind of trauma. Okay. There we go. It's figured itself out. It's not... I'm not panicking anymore. Yeah, so we want to just grab all the resources, then book it for where we just died. Grab my stuff, see if she's still there. If she's still there, then we're going to have to probably poison her to death. Oh, could be shielding without the shield. Yeah, that's a good... That's a good point. Okay. That should be one... Pretty sure it's none of these. Oh, it's that one. And that one. Alright. Fast fingers. Ooh! Shield door. Okay, so I guess eventually I might be able to put up my own base in some kind of wild location. I like the idea of that. Next time we die, if I if I get the feeling of overwhelming dread, I think maybe what I should do next time is actually go spend all of my money. Well, no. I bet I can get my money back. I bet this is one of those games. Uh, I don't really know if there's much reason to be looting the bathrooms. This area had like a smidge sometimes. Yeah, no, none of these are that helpful. Thank you, I live in my mom's basement for the additional 50 bits. Your username would have been accurate a couple years ago, but not anymore. I'm out of there. It's nice. I'm skipping a lot. I know where a number of the best loot locations kind of are. And so I'm trying to hit them up, but I don't want to spend too much time here. So what's the story so far? We are some dude in cryo, or that's been in cryo. Uh, and I don't know if we're actually the same dude every single time at this point, or if it's a separate person. Um, let's see. Give me a second, I have to puzzle here. Some of these are new pieces that I don't immediately recognize. There we go. Okay. So, we're some dude in cryo that didn't get hit by the super bone growth mad... Uh, madness inducing plague. We do seem shorter than like half these people. She is freaking tall. In comparison to quite a lot. 
I'm surprised I haven't found like a baton of some variety. But yeah, so we we wake up in um We wake up in cryo and the AI Pamela is like, "Hey, shit's screwed up. Can you help me fix it?" And presumably our character's like, "Yeah, sure thing." Um we don't actually have a voice, so I assume we just go along with stuff. But so after that point, I've effectively been been exploring this hospital, trying to find resources. All the while, uh, let's see. Cyanotube repair kit. I'm gonna get rid of the uh, shield door for the time being. I just don't have space for it. We also have a couple of energy cells, which is interesting. I think I might actually get rid of them. Yeah, I need that for a while. Heck yeah. Okay. But, so... Yeah, we've been exploring the hospital where everything kind of first went down. Obviously, like, the whole place is kind of messed up, or... Well, maybe it's not where it first went down. Did I read this one? Yeah, I did. But every time I die, I come back a little bit stronger, and all the loot respawns, so me dying a lot is actually super helpful for me. I'm pretty sure if I die sequenti sequentially, I lose all my stuff, though, which would be bad. Let's see, are we planet side or in space? Pretty sure planet side. All right, how are we doing on power? We're doing great on power. Okay, and I think I can go restock on power at kind of any point here. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. But yeah, I think we're on like a kind of floating island paradise city, supposedly. Oh. I never actually checked these drawers. I should have a long time ago. Oh, that means there's more loot in my immediate area. Have a nice day. Appreciated. Oh, that wasn't it. Who's this? Yes, all of these drawers actually have loot in them, and I've been ignoring that. What the rest of these? Did I get that one? No. Well, I got cash. But yeah, so it, it seems like this is a floating city. Uh, whatever that it expressly is going to entail, I'm not entirely sure. I'm assuming it just kind of keeps us all locked to the same area. I'm not sure what the background for why. I do want to get back to where I died, though. That's important. And yeah, increasing my max fatigue would be good. Just figured going mer mercantile might help more earlier on, but I'm poor and don't have any goodies. Okay. Yep, so it looks like this whole thing is set up. Okay, deactivated and very much powered. I don't think we really need a whole lot. We could go back to the recycler. Speaking of, is this recycler on? Yes! Okay. I just want to grab a bunch of those. Because I have next to no use for them. Let's see. I have next to no use for them just because I'm probably going to die before... I don't know. I'm I'm bad with elixir syndrome. Anything that is limited use, I will always forget about. All right. And now that we're here, have a nice day. I was kind of hoping that would actually repair the wall as well. Well, one way or another, it's fixed. Let's see. They did mention a solar sail. 
I think it's just this big thing that they put up around the uh, the city. Okay, so we're out this direction. I'm getting a lot of crafting components. For better or worse, who knows? But yeah, let's go get my stuff. It's weird. It's... It's such a strange intersection between a lot of different games. Okay, we might want to go turn the power back on. Or move it over. Let's go get my stuff, though. Hopefully, we will not have another witch. Or whatever the equivalent they're in. I forget the exact naming. Why is everything b beep -a boop -a at me? But yeah, we're most definitely on a planet. Widow, there we go. Nothing in there, nothing in either of these. Sup? Thanks. Okay. Is she back? Okay, I got all my money back. Toggle inventory. Let's move over a lot of the food stuff for a second. I want to re-equip what I've got. I think a lot of my things are kind of broken. So we might want to take what I can, go back and do some other do some other stuff. We also have not gotten like into farming. But yeah, definitely several bits of my equipment are busted. Yeah, so if I wanted to be out here, we could get the solar solar charges and have infinite money. Let's get the next spawn point though. Maybe maybe that'll have closer to what I'm looking for. But yeah, stay the heck away from a widow if I if I see one. I wish they were maybe a little easier to determine, but I think a lot of that is just kind of my own fault for being too cavalier. Thinking that I could probably deal with it. Okay, getting some cables. Do items degrade just from use or dying with them? Just from use. They do seem to have kind of a low durability though, which is a bit of a problem. What are you? What is this stuff? I think this is all just food. What is that? Why is this so expensive? Ooh, buying that. Okay, that was that was worth. So that gets me several chunks of my inventory. The seeker prefers to be called twelve. It is pleasant to have some company, but I feel guilty for not telling Jacob. Okay. Definitely a main thoroughfare. We'll leave that open, we'll come back later. What about They've you? Got a weapon. Make sure to dodge their attacks. If you can take them down, you can probably scavenge equipment from their arm. Yeah. 
I am thirsty. Alright, there we go. He had an upgrade cell. I'll take it. Upgrade. There we go. So, recharge is a little bit better. I'm not using my power as much as I probably should. I think mainly just because too many of my things have durability that I need to worry about. I'll take what I can get. How injured am I? Barely. Every time I feel a new resident being introduced, the server feels just a little bit brighter, more vibrant. If only space was not such a concern. So it seems like she's been grabbing people and like adding them to her own a AI? That seems like that backfired probably terribly. Is it that one? I think it is. Yep. Alright. What the heck are you? A shield. Hey! Okay. So what I'm looking for are... What is this? Battery backup. Oh, it requires a maintenance key, though. I haven't found any of those yet. At some point I will. But I'm... I'm, I'm hoping I can open more shortcuts. That's... Usually whenever I play a game like this with heavy exploration, my main desire is to open everything up as much as possible so I can wander around. The permit state it is to further research the decaying genetic material found in residence. I get the distinct feeling though, this is kind of its own freaking thing. Yeah, to the promenade. Yeah, so this isn't really exploration. It's food, though. Twelve derided me for making a mistake filing the official forms for Emma's eligibility certificate. I informed him that I could not have mistaken her genetic name. Not after all this time. Are they implying that Emma specifically it doesn't belong? Yeah, that's possible. Oh, it's the IVG storage upgrade and a Santa processor. Oh wait, Santa processor. And it's gone. I forget what the cyanoprocessor does. Here, let's eat and drink a little bit. Inventory's getting full anyway. This is a pretty game. Definitely want to find a base. As is it a material? Oh, maybe it is. I'm just, I'm looking for uh, cyanotubes. Which are slightly different. Another upgrade cell. That. Everything here is good. Okay. And yeah, I can just be a hacking wizard to get into most of these locations, which is nice. Uh, let's see. It's probably that one. I think we're good. What have we got in here? Sometimes I watch as residents move freely across Eden and wonder what it would be like to walk, to feel weight. I tried to stimulate it once, sadly in vain. So, for this game, you're effectively wandering around scrounging hard for resources, dying not infrequently, listening to a sad AI talking about their Pinocchio syndrome. Yeah, you know what? I'm pretty down with that. 
I am perpetually a little spooked because at some point something's gonna pop out and bite me. That's gonna suck. I think she could just use a robot body, Today, yeah. I intercepted a message from Eden33. It said that their main battery was losing mass amounts of stored energy and that they needed assistance. Did did you do anything? Is there a follow-up to that? I I guess I guess not. Alright. Uh, good luck, Eden people. Oh gosh, what a giant mess this one is. Uh, is that right? No. That's it. I did get a compute cell. If I'm not mistaken, that is for the Pamela. Yeah? Yeah. So do I want to level up this? Accumulates kinetic energy, ejects it at supersonic speeds, knocking it... Oh, you you can actually, Fusra Da. I... The idea of being able to... Just dovahkeen your way through things is kind of amusing. Okay, I can't tell that that's a locked door. Shoot. Okay, do we go up? I'm just waiting for the next... Bad goon to come for me. I'm hearing something that I'm pretty sure I should be very afraid of. Oh. That's what's going on down here. The robot's just going to town on some dude. Well, works for me. Have fun clobbering down there. I crafted my avatar on Jacob Sergi using amalgamations from various residents and Emma. I took special care in making sure it was approachable. <laughs> Dr. Hayden's fighting a robot. You're not wrong on that one. Okay, I've been down both of the wings. Oh, he was over there. Okay, so we can't... Oh. <laughs> I hate it when they charge me. Because it's not... Okay, my stamina was not coming back for any reason. <coughs> I have died. Damn it. That's a bad place. Well... A lot of EXP until the next level. Eh, no, actually, we're pretty close. Okay. Still rough. But that's okay. This is a neat game. I'm probably going to play more of this. I like... I love the idea of a lot. We definitely have to figure out how to get to our, I, the, I, uh, the Arcadia Tower Bay. So I stopped respawning in the freaking cryopod. But yeah, I was like backing up from her and I just had no stamina for whatever reason. I think we could defend ourselves a bit better. It's kind of awkward melee combat. Like it reminds me of Skyrim melee melee combat, but only fists. I was kind of hoping I'd have like a, a bat or a tool or something that I could smack things with. But it looks like it's either fist fighting or shooting. I don't need to see the skin. So I think she's cloning us. Repeatedly. Probably. Well, 